Hey, hi! Are you a corporation struggling with a sensible business model that does nothing but generate raving fans and massive profits? Well, we can help with that. We're the Woke Corporate Consultants. The past year has proven that when a corporation goes woke, they succeed at losing a dramatic amount of business while protecting themselves from profits. We'll help you position your products in a way that'll make your customers leave. That'll save you their money. Thanks to implementing our wokest strategies, CNN Plus was able to successfully burn through $300 million and go out of business after just three weeks. Believe it or not, that's not easy to do. But with our help, your results can be just as terrible. Many companies simply want to make money and provide goods and services to the people. But oftentimes, these companies become far too successful and need to find a way to slow down. And we don't want you to be left behind in slowing down. Wanna go broke? Here's how. Just take a look at Netflix, for example. We advise them to create a show about a pregnant man that's rich in radical ideologies and void of any artistic merit. We helped Netflix lose 200,000 subscribers and $50 billion from its market cap. And they'll probably be able to do even better at losing more subscribers when we pitch them our new show idea about a pregnant baby. Disney is another great example. They've used the hand of wokeness to set the bar so low it's hard to go any lower. Where they've succeeded is by pressuring children with a sexualized agenda. It's proven to be an effective strategy to help their stock value drop by $34 billion. Approximately 0.3% of Americans love Disney's woke ways of sexualizing children. That's also coincidentally the same amount of pedophiles in the country. And a pro tip for companies on social media, make sure you tweet out hashtags that have absolutely nothing to do with your business. A couple of examples we recommend using are believe all women, defund the police, and Biden 2024. Has your company denounced all Russian people yet? Do you have the Ukrainian flag in your Twitter bio? Do you insist that all your customers tattoo the Ukrainian flag onto their chests? If not, then it's like you're not even trying to lose market share. Instead of serving humanity better by focusing on providing goods and services, why don't you make cartoons for children? Speak out against someone in politics and amplify the voice of the mainstream narrative through the lens of your business. <laughs> Trust us, it'll bring your stock value way down so you can relax. Fred, tell the people at home how much money they'll save on taxes if they're making no profit. A lot. That's right. <laughs> I'll have a steak. Look, success and profitability are just outdated concepts based on old school capitalism. But we can help you transcend that energy by bringing all businesses down an equal amount. Our far left business strategies that help you go broke might sound like communism at its finest, and that's because they basically are. But we help you get there faster. Here are some questions you can ask yourself about your business. Does the Etsy shop you get your handcrafted painted jars from even have the Ukrainian flag as their profile picture? Did your local dry cleaners post a black square on Instagram? What does Evian Bottled Water think about immigration reform? Where does Olive Garden stand on police brutality? Follow-up question. Why do the breadsticks look like police batons? Does Head and Shoulders even teach their employees about critical race theory? Learn to find the answers to these questions and more when you sign up today. And also when you hire us, you can sleep better at night knowing that we give back. That's right, because we donate 10% of our profits to the fund, the defund, the police movement. And you should do the same, except by the time we're done with you, your profits will be nothing and you'll be happy about it.